what's up YouTube, back with another video, and this is another episode of Man of Medan. And where we left off, uh, we was getting something, I don't remember, but we just got up from diving. And it just, you can just go back, you know, check episode 2. And if you didn't watch this thing at all, go check all of the episodes. This is episode 1, episode 2, and this is episode 3. Anyway, let's get right into it. Got it. Let's go up. Wait, what is it? What is the it? I don't understand. Come here, you vixen. Uh, okay. Dang. All right. This... Easy, Tiger. We should get back. Whoa. Right here. So that's how we start in this episode. Uh, we got we got the juice. <laughs> You'll get no resistance there. All right, everyone. Check it out. What's this? Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? I do. So what do you think, Adam? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's mm. destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. You find anything else? There was a flight plan on board that seemed to indicate it was a rescue plane. Yeah, that makes sense. After the war, they turned long-range bombers into rescue planes. And then this plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. Mm -hmm. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. Okay, maybe nobody... No, nobody yet. Oh, come on. No one knows we've even been down there. And I don't think ghosts can talk. You Americans are all the same, huh? No respect for anyone else's traditions. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like wow. a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. Uh-oh. So I guess this is a hint. Um, so us taking stuff, we, we definitely did something bad. Um, <laughs> oh, Lord. Well, um... I never thought about it like that. You never think She's about not American. Anything. Well, maybe they, I never heard about such on? cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters, and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. True. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Yeah, sure, but, you know, nothing like what Fliss is talking about. Tell us a tale. Ooh. Let's hear it. I don't know. Let me be skeptical. Just, let's just... Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Scare away, little bro. Okay. Here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? Ah, well, down by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards. And for a dollar, he told me his secrets. Seems legit. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. <laughs> the woman answers, I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twists. Of course, the lighthouse uh -huh. keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. Drop her and the woman mind. becomes hysterical and insists her parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse and there, splayed down on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up mm -hmm. into little tiny giblets with an axe. Wait, embellish what? You know, sometimes you have to embellish the facts a little to get at the deeper truth. It's okay. Okay, so who did it? The woman says, it was my husband. And she turns to the closet, says, he's in there. Ah, yes, the husband. 
And that's why I've always been a little weary of marriage. So the lighthouse keeper Wait, creeps over to the closet. Hey, pause. How are you gonna say that but then say you guys want a happy future together? But okay. Opens the door. And sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat. Horrified. He looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees. It's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> yeah, so ah, gross. Horrible. Hey, well, super twist. Nice. That was a good story, actually. Nice one, Squire. Cool story. It wasn't scary. You have me going. Pretty cool. I think you told it better last time. But good effort. Okay. You've all had your fun? We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? Uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh-huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, man. <laughs> I'm into this website. 10-4, <laughs> good buddy. And I'm out. Oh, Lord. Alright. Y'all gotta sleep. You gotta be careful. Dang, that's loud. Wait, what is that? Duke of Milan? Milan? It's not cool, bro. Yeah, um, y'all need to get up out y'all sleep. Y'all gonna get kidnapped, killed, or both. Clippers that one part you can take out that sharp part that's what they look like it don't look like nothing harmful you telling me you you couldn't just like move his hand just rough him up a bit y'all don't know how to throw hands like what is this look, especially you Alex look you got that muscle on you tell me you can't big body them especially him the one eye working like just punch him in the eye and run disappointing Disappointing. Ungag. Um, Fliss. I'm gonna go with Fliss. <sighs> she is the captain, so she knows way more about this. Hey, 
So, uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad news is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh, god damn it, Conrad. Great, uh, just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How is that good news? I thought you were gonna ask the good news first. You're such an idiot, Jesus. Hey. Alex, what are they gonna do to us? Don't worry. If they were gonna kill us, they would have done it already. We're not just worried about being killed. Investigate. Untie, untie, untie. Guys, we gotta get untied. Like now. And if you untie yourself, you can act like you're still tied. Put your hands behind your back. It's not good. Come on. Of course. Leave. Thank you. You're taking everybody. Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. Jesus, Conrad. Trying to rob people. 
They wanted money. It's because Conrad started throwing money. Now they asking about money. Like, oh my gosh, Conrad. You're so stupid. Now we just have to wait and see what they want to do with us. We're gonna kill you. Maybe we can take it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a speedboat. You're the main guy here. He's got a gun. If we play our cards right, we can catch him by surprise. Take him All out. All right, bro. Listen, can you, you, you at least got some. Uh, we should just rush him. I can sneak out the boat. I don't know. Rush him. Ah, let's try. We should just rush him. Take the gun. They can try to fight back, but if we had the gun, they'd be forced to surrender. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> Good call. I climb out the window, climb around the side, and hit them from there. We'll take them from the other side. Don't leave us here, okay? Okay, let's do it. Bro, you still need to, You can't just put Two. these on pants on. Three. So the thunder came. Was I just supposed to hit it? Go to the other side. We'll hit them together. Dang, did I just make a mistake? Uh, oh, it's slippery too. Okay, be careful. Oh, it's one of these again. Telling me you're not athletic enough to just get that, get that gun, bang, bang. Like, what is wrong with you? You, right here. You guys Sit. have like no combat experience. No. Arrêtez, bande de cons. C'est mon bateau. Stop. Ferme la, ou je te mets mon poing dans la gueule. Put my fist in your face. Me, bro. How many of y'all go? You start jumping the guy with the gun. Get the gun, smart. Olsen! Take the gun. Bang, bang, Come boom, here. boom, pow. Like, do you guys not get it? Come on, bro. You guys aren't in that bad of a position. You guys are just scared. Which one now. of you is gonna tell me about this? Oh. Manchurian gold. Well, at least this time. Last time I played a little bit, I got up to, like, a, a small point. We didn't have... There were, we didn't have Conrad. So, like, at least now we have more people this run. So this is probably turning turning completely different. Because last time Conrad escaped. He's all the way over there. 
y'all had your chance. Alex, you should've just went in boxing class, you too, comrade. Y'all could've been, boom. You fucking blew our best shot. We could've gotten the boat back and you blew it. Yeah, I get it. All right, shut the fuck up! He's cussing so much. Look, we're only talking. I'm just say nothing, say nothing. You know what I like to hear? Nothing. That's right. Nada. Complete fucking silence. Get it? I'm just gonna say it. Flitz has got to be in on this. She, these guys, they travel in the same waters. She's the captain and they barely laid a hand on her? I bet you told them about the Manchurian gold. They're in cahoots. Let me speak the same language. It isn't true. I can't believe what I'm hearing. I just lost everything I have and this is what you think? You're all in this together. This is a trap, and you set us there up! There I am, so... What a cork, Kenny. Okay. Sit still, all of you. It was enough, huh? Please. You, come with me. Who was Brad? They certainly didn't get Brad at all. I don't even know what's there. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. You try anything, anything fishy, and there be consequences. I can barely understand him. Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Duke, we read you. Everything okay? Over. The storm. Hey, uh, just requesting any information about this storm you can give us? It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. You sound a little stressed, Duke. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. Serious problems. Nothing wrong. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A okay out here. We can handle a couple of puffs and drops of rain. Uh, thanks for the info. We'll see you for drinks back on shore in a couple of days. Alright, so now he's less worried about us trying anything sneaky. No! Oh, oh, I hit him just on time. Just on that one X button. There's a chance that we can sink. Wait, is that a chance? Oh, no, 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 no. What's this? Oh, cut and run. That's what. Boy, look at the cover. It looks like the whole thing is destroyed. High and dry. How do we. Get to here. We need Brad. I don't know where he is. He could help. He might drown. We can't no. leave him down there. He could drown. We need to get him out of there. He's not safe. Brad, buddy, come out. Dang. Oh. Dang it.
everyone's still alive. Awesome. Things could have been quite different. People could have died? Con I think Conrad would have been the one to die if we would have just cursed at the one dude. Kind-hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? What will... No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, then. We will turn to the Bard for inspiration. The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 7. The Prince of Morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads, All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story. But here's a thing. What's up? Everything may not be entirely as it seems. Wait, what? Special feature unlocked. What, is, what are these special features? Probably shouldn't have said that. Oh, well, it's a good thing we asked. Not entirely how it seems. Okay. Well, thank you for that. La porte! La porte! Mm. Why could be Conrad? He wasn't here. When I played. Why could be Conrad? What can he do different? Now this is around. Junior. Like I like last time I played a little bit in the boat. And then I got stopped at like one I think a part when I was Brad. And ever since then I didn't do anything else after that. <laughs> As long as y'all can, can't understand, right. I'm gonna bleep it out. Over there. I should have gave a um a language a uh, foul language warning before each video, but um apologize for that. Why are you looking all over? This whole place is a floating death trap. stick up so far it's gonna jump out of my neck well I feel the same way only difference is my hair is curly uh, 
Pourquoi on ne se tire pas d'ici On préférerait n'importe où d'ici. Yeah, I'm not liking this. I'm not liking this at all. Ooh. Dang it. Can't you just elbow him in the back? Fine. Fine. So aggressive. So I can't what the hell do these dickheads want with us? I can't find any clues. No clues? Ah, oh, damn. So that's Danny. Danny. Oh, shit! Oh. Okay. Why everything gotta be something small? Like some animals or something. Yes, pick it up. Pick it up. I hit X. I hit X. <laughs> huh. What's this? Internal memoriam. Memor. Random. Memorandum. Grandparents going to be small here, so you can conveniently always. Always what he has. When he has guard duty. So somebody always calls out sick during guard duty. So that means there's something. There's a reason why he doesn't want to be in guard duty. It's like in, in Friday the Freddy's. There's a reason why someone shift changed their shift to daytime to the nighttime. There's a problem, bro. Again, this is the third time this week. None of us like it down there. Maybe Patterson should buck up. Just get it. Get on. no, just get on it. But I kept it. Secret question mark? When I would have told me. Wait, is it, was his hand glowing? No, that's a flash. I was like, what to say? Can I take the gun? That would have been cool. Oh, wait. I don't want to go down there first. Don't you dare push me back. Move. Don't do it. Ah. So now I know I got to walk through here slower because, like, I can walk past the room that something good will be in there. What's up? Just push You're about to see. Okay. To All of us into the room. Wilson. I forget which one's Danny. I don't know the other guy's name. I think he's Danny, the one in the back with the hat. I think that's Danny. Hey! It's pitch black in here! Give us a light! You got a light. What the hell is this fucking place? An abandoned ship. Those me heads seem spooked. Dude, even those meatheads seem spooked. You think this ship is the Manchurian gold? We are in the vicinity of those coordinates. Oh, wow. We can't just sit around. We need a plan. Yeah. We're not exactly in the best position to be making any moves. True that, true that. The second they let their guard down, we gotta take advantage of it and get off the ship. It's dangerous here. I'm... Hurt too bad. How are you hurt? No. Yeah, man. This whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. We already tried to escape. Didn't exactly work out. They swiped our distributor cap. Gonna be difficult to get anywhere without it. Uh. Yeah, what is it? So, okay, what exactly is a distributor cap? Pretend you're talking to someone who doesn't know anything about boats. Well, typically, a distributor cap is designed to distribute voltage from the coil to the correct rotor, which in turn... It's an essential part of the engine. We're not taking the Duke of Milan anywhere without it. While those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. True, true. Fliss, I just wanted to say that um, I might have gotten things kind of wrong back there. Might have? Uh, excuse me? I may have kind of prematurely come to the conclusion that maybe 
you know, you're working some kind of side deal with these guys or whatever. But I, I mean, obviously that's not true. They're being just as bad to you as they are to us. So, yeah. Allow me to translate. He's saying that he's sorry. Well, I... <laughs> hmm. Well, your apology is kinda accepted. Cool. Cool. Kinda cool. Oh, okay, maybe I can find different things. Wait, there's something over here. What's this? What is? It's a newspaper. What happened here? It's burnt? I can't read nothing. Yes, I can. Gangland? So, when we told you this would be a quick little adventure, was there something in the small print? Should we expect an itemized bill for all these? Uh, so people going extras? missing in yeah. Kidnapping? some type of mountain. Extra time, three fifty an hour. Listening to your stupid bickering, I'll get back to you on that one. At least you're not charging us for the damage to your boat. The, oh, what are they trying to? I am now. Yo, can y'all be quiet? I'm trying to commentate, bro. Y'all talked all that time. Goodness, disrespectful. All right. We could check. The, nah, they just gonna yell at us. Is this another picture? Oh, what's that? I wonder Dude. why this was ripped off. Yeah, that's strange. What's this? That's a dog. That's weird. Wait. Wait, no, 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 wait. There's something else. Oh, that's what he was talking about, ripped off. I thought he was talking about the thing scratched on the painting. Nah, this is SS? SSE? Kinda looks like an E. It's ripped off. What do you think this ship was? Can't really figure it out. Oh, a letter. I'm right. Well, you know the thing. You know the deal. If you want to read it, um. Great. Of all the places. No, 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 no. no. Pick it back Alex, up. Pick it back up. I'm really scared. Dang it. Don't worry, sis. He got you. Alright. I you like crazy three months to So I, I guess this is basically, um. I'm sure if you guys want to. Yeah, if you guys want to read. If you guys want to read, just pause the video and read it real quick. So I guess this is one of the crew members. And, um. He was, um, writing back to one of his real, family members. Real creepy. Wait, aren't these Brad's glasses? I really don't want to know what these guys are going to do with us. Hey, keep your eyes peeled for another, uh, opportunity. You feel me? Yeah, comrade. We got you. Hey, but look, five heads is better than four, right? So, you know, it's not that bad of a choice nice. that I made. Mmm. Way to escape. <sighs> Come here, boys. Look what I Look found. Look what I found over here. Are you just gonna steal my line? Okay, Conrad. Kick it. Oh, this is the same thing. What am I doing? Stop it. Stop it. Alright, um... Oh, I don't have the chance to talk to them again. Ah, dang. What do I do now? Just check the door? Like... Go help. I'm gonna help my man. I'll this. take a look. Can you move? You said come take a look, right? Any luck? I can't get it open. Hey, come here. If we can bust it open, freedom. Mm. Oh, 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 we don't know where a bit like this would go. True. Wherever it leads, it can't be worse than here. Want me to just smash through this wall? 
to oh, let the yeah, noise sure. Work. Big man on campus. Someone should create a distraction. This is gonna be loud. Yeah, okay. Conrad, you do it. Oh, there we go. Nice. Barricade. Um, distract. Conrad, you have to do some this time. Hey! Yeah, you, Long John Silver and shit, uh, what are you guys doing out there? Pieces of eight and shiver me timbers, you one-legged fuck faces! Yeah, you smarmy farmant! Yeah, no, you, I'm gonna rip your pirate parrots off your shoulders and stomp them into rainbow-colored stew! Hey, hey. I'm warning you, I am an American citizen. You really want yeah. my president yeah. coming after you guys? Because he will. You. Each and every one of you <laughs> personal. What's that? Very, very personal. Hey, can you hear me? I I'm talking to you. Hello? some stairs around here. Alright, time to look for secrets. Episode should be ending soon. Oh! Extra guard duty regulations. Due to special occasion. Double guard duty. Talking, playing games, smoking, talking. Okay. Alright, what else is in here? That has to be more than that, right? Maybe out here. Maybe I should have just kept up with them. I feel like I'm gonna get jump scared. What's in here? Dirty clothes? Don't touch that. Don't touch and it. And there's the mystery of the smelly socks and pungent briefs. Weird. So what else is around here? Is that it? I guess is this a washing machine? <laughs> oh my gosh. They don't need to do that to my soul. Wait, let me check again. Haha, <laughs> look. All that just for some more clothes. I ain't that sound. Huh. Huh. Oh gosh, I hate my curiosity. Can I not go around this way? No? Okay. Gonna go all the way back. All the way back. I'm not checking that. Alright, well, we're leaving. I'm tired of this place. We're just gonna stay with the other people so we don't die. Cause that would be a shame. What was that? Did I just see something? Why did it look like when I was leaving that there was a person? I'm tripping. I'm tripping. I just want to know where the hell they all went. There should have been dozens of people on board. Hundreds. How could they all just vanish? And leave all of their stuff behind? Something doesn't add up. Yeah, it definitely does not add up. Whatever happened at the beginning of the game, that don't even make sense to me. Probably figure out where's the you are here arrow. Um, I have no clue. That's what there might be one, so let me just make sure. All right, oh, did I just discover something? 
No. They're just trying to scare me. <laughs> you ain't getting me. What was that? Some falling stuff. to his um daughters or or maybe his wife, I don't know. We see his daddy, so I'm pretty sure um pretty sure that's his daughters. Sounds like Ted. I know he's just messing with me. There ain't no way he gonna stole away. What? Wait, he's talking. About so somebody else is talking about a little boy on board. Said it looks like it's Ted. Like it can't be the one guy we played against, not played with, um, before, right? Because then the guy who signed the name, his name had to be Charles. It was Robert XXX. You hear that? If by that you mean the terrifying sound, then no, I didn't hear anything. You know you did. Charles was it something moving? Something moving would make that sound. Sure. Anything? Anything? I am so freaked out. It's yep. okay. Me too. I'll protect you. No, I'll protect you. Big bro got you. What's that? Oh, I think they're down this there. This place is fucking massive. Alright. What is this place? Engine room? Well, is there anything we can use down here? We're gonna no need clue. That's what I'm looking for now. Where are we gonna get out of here? All right. So seems like. Hello. No, I heard whispering. Who are you to? I don't like that. A book. So many clues. So many secrets that, that aren't registered as secrets. Can I open this thing? Yes, sir. Um. I oh, love words. Did I find a problem? Okay, so this is just like just a, di a diary. What? Just trying to skim through this. It's blown up and destroyed. What was blown up and destroyed? Cables are locked. Okay. I don't know what that's supposed to do. Hey, that's there. Let's just keep going. Come on, sis. Come on, sis. Alright. Um, 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 um. I don't know if I like this room. What's this? Wait, wait, wait. What's that? Is that goat? No, that's a, like, a red skull. Yup. On it, put that down. Okay, anything over here? That, ah, saw some sparkles. There's a lot of things we need to make sure we don't miss because it could be clues. How to more diary stuff? Oh, Lord. Okay, put that down. 
So there's diaries in here. Guess of like them crew members, the act of soldiers, or whoever. Um, anything else before I end this episode? Anything? Cause I want to get to <sighs> what? Oh no! I was so confused. No, I didn't like. That. Wait, no, hold on. There's something over here. What's this? A picture. So th there's a chance, um, there's a, a w um, there's a chance that Alex can get separated from the group and then get beaten up a lot. <laughs> um, let's see. Ooh, so yeah, some of the, some of the clues did help. What was this? That diary thing? Maybe I should be careful with just on the books back down because maybe a certain page is triggers the stuff. Alright. Well, I'm gonna end it off for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget leave a like, subscribe if you're enjoying this. Because I know I am. And I'm gonna be glad to make more of this. Anyway, and um that's it. Share with your friends and follow my Instagram. If you don't got Instagram, then make an Instagram. Alright, peace.